What is going on, Safeman Army? It is Safeman Surge here yet again with another video for you all today. To all my reoccurring viewers, thank you so much for all the love and support that each and every single one of you have shown me. To all the new viewers, welcome to Safe Moon, a community driven innovation for good. If you have not yet, consolidate to V2 Safe Moon on the Safe Moon wallet or on the swap. And with that being said, uh, let's make sure to like comment and subscribe i do appreciate all the love and support that you guys have shown all these previous videos you guys can go back and watch them if you choose to this one right here is really good safe moon is in the delivery phase and then also this one right here safe moon will be in the 12th sec sector of the s p so all these other videos are great so make sure to go check them out and with that being said let's take a quick look here at bsc scan currently sitting at 656,009 addresses for V2 per BSC scan. The price of SafeMoon had this nice buy-in right here. You guys can see this nice big green candle here and then this consolidation around the 2010. So a very, very nice. I like to see these nice green candles here. Um, we've had been coming down, kind of consolidated, came back down. So um, not too much price action as of right now, but we are slowly but surely getting there. <clears throat> the SafeMoon army is wondering what's coming next because SafeMoon, the team, the official team has been very quiet. We haven't had any posts in the last like three days. Sorry about that. We haven't had like any posts in the last three days with uh, SafeMoon and it's the calm before the storm. Current volume is sitting at 1.4 million per 24 hours. It's looking good. Um, definitely always anything over a million makes me happy, uh, as you guys know. But with that, let's take a quick look here at Twitter. And if you guys haven't, follow me on Twitter at SafeMoon Surge. But John put this on Discord. Jonathan White, also known as Sketch, was an easy hire. Can't argue with John Madden's recommendation of him. He also put this this morning. I see we have new flavors of FUD Flakes today. Fantastic. Was getting sick of the old flavor. So John Caroni is having fun with all this FUD, right? Because he knows what's coming. He knows what's in the pipeline for SafeMoon. And I know there's a lot of people that will comment down in the comment section, what products, blah, 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 right? But listen, we have something coming. There's something coming, you know, regardless of the ones of what we're aware of, right? It is very odd to think that SafeMoon has been very quiet these last couple days, okay? The last three, four days. It's not like Safe Moon to not post something. And I think they're just preparing. Even though we have like John Caroni, Mr. Adult coming out on Discord saying certain things, any official statements from Safe Moon hasn't really been announced. Um, so I think they're waiting. Um, could it be possible? I, I personally think they're waiting to announce the new app update for the router upgrade and then. For the swap and evolve to be implemented um, once that's ready to go they're going to make an announcement about it go update your wallets router upgrade is completed cross chains boom now after that what will we get probably something in regards to mandela right mandela is still working on getting everything implemented they're going to do low tox which is local tokenomics within their centralized exchange first and then they're going to do glow tox which is global tokenomics so could we get that next week is the midweek of april right um so we'll kind of have to see how that plays but we did get an update still happening next week question mark for safe moon and then one of the people from Mandela said no exact date yet once we have one we will announce it so i think Mandela will see it the week after next um or even the last week of april is when we will see officially mandela coming out right um simply because of the fact that their target date was mid-april um but i could see them just kind of pushing it off a little bit longer and i know people don't like to hear that but then again it is just the beginning of q2 we are getting the safe moon card the wait list has already been put out so I'm very excited. I think we're going to get more 
on the Safe Moon card at some point this month? Um, could it be, you know, what to expect, when to expect it? Or it's just going to be a simple, like, hey, your virtual card, you know, is ready, essentially. So do KYC. So we will kind of see how things play out here in the next two to three weeks, to be honest. Um, I'm very excited. I'm very bullish with the SafeMoon card. Um, and then also the exchange. Um, I'm very excited about that. I'm excited for the cross chains. That's going to be massive. Um, so there are a lot of things still happening this month. And so I think people just need to understand that things are just kind of progressing at the right time. We're in the delivery phase. That's what makes me so bullish. We're in the delivery phase, but they want to release it at the right time, not just whenever. So, you know, we did see a huge um, announcement with Robinhood and SHIB, which is great news for altcoins. And that's just kind of like, I think, the catalyst to alt season. Um, even though we did see like a 25% increase in, you know, price for SHIB. We really didn't see too much happen afterwards. It kind of just, you know, initial hype and then it's kind of leveled off now. Um, because we are still in the bear market, that's re the reason why. We're still in the bear market. SHIB didn't take off like crazy um, with that Robin Hood announcement as many people probably thought it would. Um, but we'll see. I mean, it's just a matter of time. I think it's just, I think timing I think it'll just be multiple catalysts. So all season is 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 we're on the precipice of it. We're at the point where it's like how much further can this rubber band be pulled back, or how much more can we continue to be in the spare market before it just releases and takes off. So you know, let me know what your guys' thoughts are. You know, there's there's different altcoins that I'm I'm invested in as well, but Safe Moon is is the one that I'm the most bullish on. Uh, not financial advice, but it is the one that I have my biggest investment in. And so at the end of the day, I really want to see SafeMoon succeed, but I also really want all these other altcoins to succeed. Um, so there's some really good projects out there. there. I'm not saying there isn't, but at the end of the day, I think everybody ultimately wants the same thing. So with that being said, though, make sure to like, comment and subscribe follow me here on twitter at safe moon surge i do appreciate you all and again you know if you guys haven't make sure to subscribe let's get this channel to 10,000 subscribers like i mentioned in my previous video i've been here since july come on safe moon army continue to share this channel you guys are awesome you know and i'm always just going to continue to do safe moon content that's all it's going to ever be on this channel um, so just make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and I will talk to you all in the next one. God bless.